All right, what's up, Paul Squad? Welcome back. So it's now time for another Zephyr Karate Kid recap. So this is going to be part two. Jaden Smith is a fraud. <laughs> Jaden Smith is a fraud. Wow, what a title. But yes, um, there's actually a part two of his recap from the first, first part one recap. Um, Jaden Smith was getting cooked. So this is um, a three part, which is awesome, which is great, because I know his next title, Jaden Becomes Hint Smith, the finale, which is basically the terminate. Um, the, the final scene of the Karate Kid reboot. <clears throat> so, I'm there for I see it. So, it's a whole squad. Let's go jump right into it. Part two of Zephyr's Karate Kid recap. Jake Smith is a fraud. <laughs> That's how stuff is layers as hell. But, anyways, Hall squad, let's check this out. It's about to go down. And now, our feature presentation. <laughs> Start up Spider Man 3. <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, man. <laughs> this makes one of the Spider Man 3 again. Jeez. I can't let this nigga <laughs> slide! I tried, y'all. I tried so hard. <laughs> I tried so hard to be a better person. I was out here reading Vinland. I have no enemies. But I just can't let Jaden Smith go. This <laughs> man, Jaden Smith. Just pisses me off yeah. that much. So I got to get back on here, starting exactly where we left off. So bro's out here in the cafeteria. He's trying to hit some moves on this little Asian shorty. And I'm out here like, hold on. Why is Concrete Smith moving like me right now? Yeah. I'm out here applying pressure like crazy, risen her up. She out here calling him funny like, okay. Cement Smith, you cannot box to save your life, but what you can do is riz. I'm about to give you a little clap for that. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, he's I'm really about to post so. these two on my IG story and be like, me and who? That's about to be me with my Valorant Ethot. You just gotta wait on the <laughs> guys. Thought. Trust. It's coming soon, I promise. But nah, it's 30 seconds into a scene and Jaden Smith he's hasn't taken an L? Something clearly ain't right. And I'm pretty sure even Chang felt that there was a disturbance in the force. Because the moment his shorty walked away, he's right behind him. Yeah, yeah, he's right behind him. Food all over his new fit. Unprovoked menace behavior. This man just eats oh chalk. And these guys are really about to box until the teacher done pulled up. Now, this teacher, we gonna have to get to her because I'm looking at her, I'm giving her the <laughs> biggest side eye right now. She hiding stuff that we do not know she about. She though. They gotta go their separate ways and the next day starts. And Cement Smith is yet again applying pressure. It's crazy how this man holds the biggest L counter in the entire <laughs> universe, but he still has more riz than some of y'all. Yeah. Please, get your notebooks out and take some notes. This man is cooking. Yeah. I really gotta respect a brother for shooting, but I'm not gonna lie. Even this man's riz is horrible. Close your <laughs> books. She says she's trying out for the Beijing Art and Music School, and he has the audacity to drop this right here. Their initials spell BAM! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I don't know what two brain cells uh. in his head made him cook this and then had bro thinking like, oh yeah, this the one right here. She ain't give not a laugh, not a smile, not a chuckle. She was just distraught. This is the <laughs> pure definition of harassment. Someone locks this nigga up. But after this absolute <laughs> horrible demonstration of quote unquote riz, this man walks outside and he sees Chang and his two shooters. Oh, my <laughs> two God. shooters. The L's just keep piling up. I don't know how he survives this. Chang over here copying the girl, talking about some, can I touch your hair? At this point, I would have been like, <laughs> like, man, <laughs> devious acts like this. I know Chris Rock was directing every single move this Hell man nah. did. And he was definitely re watching it, deep faking Will Smith's face on top of Jay. Having the time of his life. You're a fraud. Oh but they out here kicking his bag, throwing uh, it in the air, dumping <clears> everything out of it. And then Chang rolls up on him and says, Don't ever show yourself near us again. Like he wasn't the one who came to him first? This is crazy. Someone right? put the bat signal up. Please, the demon child is running amok. If I was in this position, I would have been pissing myself. Now, yes. someone in the comments of my last video accused me of glazing Chang a little too much. Right? It's like. Have we seen the same movie? Because if you look at this man, it's very hard not to glaze him. In the direct next scene, Jaden decides to go to the dojo because you know he needs to learn some moves. This man is getting cooked by everything. He needs some self-defense. <laughs> so he goes to the dojo and look at who he sees. Yep. Yep. Oh nah. <laughs> no. Bro hit the most nefarious smile too. He wanted to make sure he appeared in his nightmares. And this scene right here is absolutely insane. The moment they start their drill, look at how Chang turns at this nigga. 
This nigga gets Yo. kicks out of this. Oh my Hell god. No. I don't care how good Jaden's mom's job is. He does not get paid enough hair. for Jaden to go through this amount of torment. Send him back to Detroit, please. And then next up, we got the field trip. Jaden, once again, applying pressure. I'm telling you, my brother was straight cooking. He was a chef. This man out here applying more pressure on a female than seniors. <laughs> Them freshman forensic ass niggas. Yeah. The moment they hear she in the night, they nice. talking about some, where my hug at? In jail! <laughs> it was not safe. Chang was out here plotting the moment he started risen. Staring at bro like how Akaza was getting stared at in Demon Slayer. <laughs> and then once they on the bus, this I man tries to Slayer. bother Jaden again. And this is the part that I'm talking about. Look at the teacher. <laughs> Don't play that. <laughs> I'm over here talking about Chang. She's the real threat of the movie. Her chakra must run mad deep. If just your <laughs> eyes is getting this crayon eating demon shook, you know she got something cooking. And once again, man, look at Concrete hitting Riz. <laughs> she invited bro over to the festival and everything. And look at this cute little eye contact they got going on. Oh, <laughs> Concrete, <laughs> that's you? Oh, nah, I didn't know bro had it like this. What? That's crazy. What do these 12 year olds even do, bro? Kiss under the slide or something? Back in my prime, I was the shorty slide slayer. I don't know if this man got it like me, but I'ma let you cook, little bro. You ate you just this one thing, one. just this one. one. And after this, I already got to this scene where Concrete Smith makes the literal worst plan I've done ever seen within a film. I can't even call this a lick back or a revenge because this was absolutely horrible. I do not. Am get I here for some five music in background? What he was trying to do. All he wanted to do was get this nigga wet. See ya. Huh? This what man gave you a <laughs> black <laughs> eye. You pulled up to your first day of school with foundation on, my boy. Pissing his cereal or something. What are you doing? You see why I couldn't let him slide? I can't even sit here and talk about the movie without getting pissed off. This thing gets <clears> me so bad. I completely forgot about this for the foundation made me remember. Look at how Jaden Smith comes out the bathroom. I don't know who you trying to stun out for, bro. You're not him. <laughs> in all these videos, I be talking about the drip that these characters have. And the reason why I haven't done it in this video, I'm not gonna lie, nobody in this movie is <laughs> This is my mentor. And once Chang finished his NFL chase down on Jaden Smith, had this nigga kissing concrete for the 50th time <laughs> in this film, even his boys were getting kind of scared of bro. I'm not gonna lie. One of them was like, all right, bro, you gotta chill out. And then he's like, nah. I ain't finished with this nigga. Speaking like he's him Han himself. Hmm. This she is crazy. He about to strike the finishing blow, and then here comes the GOAT. Yeah, Jackie, Jackie Chan. Chan. Yes, sir. Here to give Concrete so, he was so good in this. W of the film. He pushes Chang back, and Chang ain't never ran from no smoke. His boys is like, let's jump this nigga. He's like, nah, I got this. He pulls up, and he was about to hit this nigga with the cleanest kick. But Chang didn't have his Pokedex on him. He would have known that Jackie Chan's type is <clears> jump <throat> resistant. He straight grabs his foot and then pushes him down, and then it becomes an all-out brawl. Mm -hmm. This man's using straight ultra instinct on these kids. He's not even hitting any of them. He's this was a good fight, themselves though. to hit each other. Bro threw one of the little niggas in a trash bag. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, oh y'all niggas getting smoked. <laughs> and this is something that I noticed when I was analyzing this fight. And yet again, this movie refuses to sleep on an opportunity to show you that Chang is that nigga. Yeah, and always this been. Movie, Yes. Always been the goal. Meet Guzzling. But he is the only kid throughout this fight to actually get Jackie Chan on the defensive. Bro looks shocked and had to dodge two of his kicks. He ain't do this for any other strike. Hmm. I'm telling you, in the deleted scenes of Infinity War, when Thanos was pulling up with his henchmen, Chang was supposed to be there. <laughs> I don't even think the Prime Avengers could have handled this kid. I'm not even going to lie. Stupid. Especially with Hulk. Sorry, yeah, bro. Try. This man <laughs> twirled the kid around and then spun him like a fruit roll up just so he could backhand oh. the other kid. Oh, Lord. This man was straight cooking in his hole, and he does this twice. Look at this, <laughs> bro. I'm crying. This man is just playing with him, and then he's out here fighting all three of them at once. This man thinks he's son Goku in this hole. I don't even know how he did this, but he ended up ending the fight through one of this nigga's jackets, yeah. and then tangled all these niggas up, and then threw them all to the floor. This she is absolutely crazy, man. Please watch this scene for yes. yourself. If yes, you it's right. That's it's awesome crazy. scene. Concrete Smith is not taking that. <laughs> I gotta Smith. check and make sure I'm watching the right movie <clears> because <throat> this is kind of strange. But yet again, I spoke too soon. When they was at the festival, my boy even secured the kiss. At his age, that's basically securing the bag, man. <laughs> and he fumbles. See, I knew yeah. he was taking way too many Ws. And knowing this fraud 
of a main character, he's gonna fumble in the funniest way possible. So he's out here sweet talking to his girl yet again, straight serenading her like, damn, bro. Someone get the thermometer. This man's Asian fever is red hot. Chill out, bro. This she ain't going nowhere. And then her parents call her. Talking about some, your performance was moved to today. And since she's with Jaden, she's already late. So her parents hmm. end up picking her up and she has to drive all the way to the auditorium. Jaden somehow makes it there right when she's about to perform. And she did what she had to do. And when she finished, this Clark Kent, let me hold the door for her. <laughs> Ad nigga starts standing up and clapping for her and everybody's just staring at him like you don't see everybody else we is not rocking with you gang <laughs> and this part right here is straight crazy he tries to talk to the white dude in front of him my nigga just leaves yeah. man this nigga try <laughs> and the girl walks up to him and she's like i'm sorry we can't be together no more and i'm not gonna lie i don't even blame shorty right here she a bad chaser just like me and this man cement smith radiates so much l energy she's getting slimed up the bag i would leave that nigga too i promise you <laughs> How long is this video? I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm gonna end it right here. Oh, dang. <laughs> you need to leave. I know normally I would go the extra mile, but I just dropped a 27 minute video on y'all heads. Make sure y'all peep that. But this next video is going to be straight boxing. We're doing the whole tournament and I promise it's going to be straight heat. And y'all not going to have to wait a month for it this time. I got one Tom Holland video that's basically done and a hmm. Yu Yu Hakusho video that I have slated for this week. So y'all can wait a week and a half for part three. Right? So I can check him down now. Right. All right. Nice. Nice. But yeah, um, that fight with um, Jackie Chan fighting the bullies was awesome. I have to admit, Jackie Chan had one of the best performances in the movie, hands down. So, and yeah, the next title is Jaden becomes him Smith, the finale. So yeah, this is the whole tournament most likely. So yeah, that that was a great recap, great recap, man. So there you go, our squad. But yeah, I I got more Zephyr reactions I'm gonna do y'all for y'all um later this month, oh next week or so. But yeah, absolutely great, great um recap right there. Hell yeah. That's why he's here, baby. That's why he's the GOAT! The GOAT! So, Hot Squad, there you have it. That was part two of Zeth Fire's Karate Kid reboot recap. Jaden Smith is a fraud. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, this is this was great. This was hilarious. Another great recap, you know. So, I'm definitely excited to see the last one, you know, with Jaden Smith. No, I'm Jaden Smith. Um, Dre Parker is his character's name. Um, he goes to tournament and he, you know, um, Starts beating down the bullies, you know, so I'm definitely excited to see that. So, Hall Squad, please stay tuned because I have part three already coming up in a few minutes. So, please stay tuned.